Hi guys, Merry Christmas. It's Kristen, I am sister number two, and I am in my kitchen today sharing a super easy Christmas treat. So today I am making saltine cracker English toffee. Now if you've never made English toffee out of the saltine crackers, you've gotta start now because really it is so easy and good and it's not like the English toffee that's really hard and pretty much breaks your teeth in half. Um, this toffee is a little bit softer because of the saltine crackers. Come watch as I make saltine cracker English toffee. One more thing before we get started, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, now is a good time. Go ahead and subscribe to us and you'll catch all of our fun recipes and ideas that we share here on YouTube. Okay guys, let's go make it. So you're first gonna start by putting foil on a cookie sheet. Now if I would do it again, I would put foil also going the other way so you don't see any cookie sheet at all. But it's okay. So now I take about two sleeves of saltine crackers and then just lay them side by side next to each other so you fill up the whole entire pan. Then in a saucepan, you're gonna take one cup of butter one cup of brown sugar, and then you're gonna put it on medium-high heat and let it boil for three minutes. Now once it's done boiling, you're going to quickly take it and spoon it onto the crackers. Now be really careful, it's really hot and it's gonna become sticky once it starts to dry. So you wanna do this as quickly as possible. As you're putting it on, the crackers might move a little bit, but that's okay. You can try and put them back into place the best you can. Once you put all your sauce on, then you're going to lightly spread it very carefully so you try and cover all edges of the salting crackers. Now, like I said before, it starts to get sticky as it dries, so it starts to kind of bunch up and become a little bit thicker. That's good. That means you did it right. So just try the best you can to spread it all over those crackers. Now, if you didn't see it before, make sure to preheat your oven to 400 degrees because these are gonna go in the oven as soon as I can spread the caramel around. When you're all done, you just take it and put it in the oven for about five minutes. Now, as soon as you pull it out, you have to get to work and start putting two cups of milk chocolate chips on. So I let the chocolate chips rest on the burning hot crackers for about two minutes. Then I started spreading the chocolate around. The original recipe only called for a cup and a half of chocolate chips, but I just like to pour on the whole entire bag because, I mean really, you can never have enough chocolate at Christmas time. Now it's time for the toppings. I like to add Christmas sprinkles, but you can add nuts, you could add walnuts, pecans, peanuts, really any kind of nuts you like on top. But I want the kids to actually like it, so we're adding all kinds of fun Christmas sprinkles. And notice how I poured the sprinkles in my hand first. You have a little bit more control when you do that instead of just sprinkling it all on. And there you have it, our easy saltine cracker English toffee. When you're done and after it's cooled, I just broke it apart with my hand. Anyways, in case you haven't done so, subscribe to our channel and be sure to check out our other Christmas episodes. Okay guys, see you later.